Hello and welcome back to Let's Play Colonization with me, Grey Hunter, where we were preparing to declare independence from the King of England and his tyrannical rule. Though not quite yet, because we're not suicidal. We need more men. More men. And where are we going to get them? Well, immigration. Hopefully some culture pops. Uh, not culture pops, population pops. And through some training of expert farmers. So I think what I might do with the first couple of uh, graduates from Port Royal is make them into expert farmers and send them to different places like Georgetown or Plymouth places that could do with a bit of um, a population growth increase and in aid of that I'm gonna send this fellow over to New London where he is going to create a farm here and didn't we have another one or was the other one actually busy could have sworn we had another uh, hardy pioneer around somewhere. Is he there? Nope. A brave is there, though. Hmm. Oh, that's right. He was uh, he was building out a road over here. There he is. So he actually is done, I believe. So we will send him to... Is it here we want to send him? No. It was... Actually... Another farm at Port Royal might not be the worst thing in the world. That place doesn't actually have a farm. It's jungle grassland. I don't know if we can build a farm there. It is restricted in this... Uh, in colonization. So... You guys have guns too, don't you? Yes, you have plenty of guns. So, you need to take those guns to Georgetown. And that will be that. Cool. Uh, 49 tobacco to help the colonists in New London. Thanks, Wanaka Puck. You're a real bro. Now, seasoned scout. What are you doing here? Did I pull you back? I must have. That's right. I uh, told him to come back here after the Cherokee did that whole let's declare war on the English thing, didn't I? Well... I might make you a Dragoon, seeing as we've got the uh, the weaponry and you're actually fairly good. So, change profession. Dragoon! Oh, there we go. Nice. Alright, chill out there. Excellent. Now you, you need to drop off some of your guns. And then you can continue on to New London. Excellent. Now... We're doing okay on funds for now, but I'd like to start selling some things to the natives. So what I'm going to do is, after f the fortress has been built here... Unless you're on a trade route? No, you are in a trade route. Actually, I might just use this fella. After he's done delivering some guns. We're going to try selling some of our finished goods off to the natives. For fun and profit. Alright, go there. Um... Go back and grab more guns, actually. Oh, no. No, you don't need to do that for now. Uh, go get some rum. They want guns, I believe that is. No, they want tools. Well, we can provide those. What about you guys? You want horses? Maybe. Don't know what you want. You want horses. You want tools. You don't want anything. That's right, we already looked at you, didn't we? Hmm. Well, we'll find some stuff for them. Continue on. So it is 1640, and we can choose the speciality for the graduating student in Jamestown. Let us grab... Actually, let us have a look first. I want to know if we've got any churches that aren't being used. Georgetown, no. Port Royal, no. New London, no. So you could build one in three turns. Three turns, done. All right, well that decides what we're getting. We're getting a firebrand preacher. Uh, I could kiss your ring for the bargain price of 2,770 gold. Yes, you are correct, but I could also tell you to go fuck yourself. Goodbye. Okie dokie. Uh, so New London, off you go. Should get there just as it's finishing, so that should be excellent. You, 
you, you, you, you, you. You can take this rum and these horses, why not? We'll sell the natives some horses. At least we're not selling them guns. Also, if you have a defensive pact with the natives because they like you enough, you can actually call them into your War of Independence. They'll help you out. Sort of like the Iroquois when the, um, the British were fighting the French, though slightly different, obviously, because they're not. That wasn't a war of colonial um, independence. It was a war of colonial expansion. But the same principle. Unless the Iroquois weren't on the... The Iroquois might have been fighting for the French, and I'm thinking of someone else. Actually, yeah, I'm pretty sure I am. Yes, because in The Last of the Mohicans, that's right, the Iroquois are the bad guys. Um, so who... well, Mohicans, I guess. Cherokee, maybe? Cherokee fought for the, for the Brits? I don't know. I don't know. Someone will correct me, I'm sure. But you get the idea. Same principle. Same principle. Uh, let's see. There's really not all that much that we need to do during these turns. We're sort of just blitzing through them, but the revolution needs to begin soon. Or at least in the relatively near future. Pocahontas has joined Louis de Frontenac. <laughs> well, I hope you're pleased with that investment, Louis. He's probably just trying to outscore me. Son of a bitch. Hello, trade negotiations. What would you give me for these? 625 gold. Uh, no. What about that? Okay, what would make that deal work? Alright, let's clear everything. What will you give me for that? Sure. Done. We will go trade horses to somebody who actually wants them. Maybe they will provide us with a bit more money in that case. Because that seems like not very much for those horses. Okay, there's a Dutch missionary rock wandering around there. What are you doing? Missioning, I suppose. Church should be finished this term, excellent, and a speciality for the graduating student. Soldier! Uh, you can build... Uh, you know what? Get a cathedral, just because you can. You can take up a gun. Congratulations, you are now armed. You need to get over there. Your mission is con converted a native. Yes, excellent. Join the settlement. And yes, you've already been set to where you need to go. You can sleep there for a minute. You... Actually, you first. Can you build a farm? You can build a farm there, good. That's... wait, that's not the bananas, is it? No, that's the bananas. Good, good, good. Uh, how long until someone graduates from here? Nine turns. Seventeen. Actually, no, we know that we can fit a student in there, so go over there instead. Perfect. Uh, you're doing your thing. Let us continue. Alright, you've constructed a college in Port Royal. What would you like to do next? University, preferably, but that would cost a lot. Take a long time as well. Let's see. Four turns, seven turns. You know, a college here is actually probably good enough. Let's just go with stockade for now. Uh, Jack, Jacques Marquette has offered to join your cause. Will you welcome him as part of your Continental Congress? Plus one movement for scout isn't really our thing, so no. No, thank you, sir. As wonderful as you are, or at least as wonderful as I'm sure you are, you are not part of our plan. Now, where did I leave my boat? There's where I left my boat. Is there anything good to send? Hmm. Well, you can load up there. Tools here. Hmm. I could probably build after that fortress is done. Um, another... Another... Not another. Up, uh, the upgrade to the armory, which is a magazine. God, it took me so long there. <laughs> Completely derped out for a minute. Um, let's see. Well, we've got some good stuff that we can send back. So let's load up ship. Um, yeah, we'll load up ship with everything here. Cool, cool. Uh, we'll leave the coats for now until we've got enough of them. 
That's a... Oh, yeah. We'll just leave everything for now. Good, good. You can sleep for a minute. And we actually need that wagon train back because I'm an idiot and I forgot that I need to transport wood and iron ore from different settlements over to Jamestown to keep it functioning. Well. Well. We'll deal with that in a minute, I suppose. Hello. Thanks. You're a real champ. Frame rate, what are you doing? I don't like it when you go all funky. It just strikes the, you know, bad manners. Cool. Done, done. And we'll grab a wagon train. Yes, because we need one. Hello. What would you give me for those? Really fine. It's not very much, but alright. Fine, fine, fine. Back we go. Okay. Continue on. We'll need to go back to selling goods soon enough. Yes, that is actually kind of worth it. We'll need to go back to selling things soon enough. Because we'll need money to pay for the graduation of different people. I think expert farmers are free though. But, as you can see, we grabbed uh, one of the military founding fathers. Paul, I'll call him, because I have no idea how to pronounce the rest of his name. And he's actually doing quite well for us, because formation is a plus 25 versus mounted units, and because I like using the infantry a lot, uh, a lot more than I like using dragoons, mainly because they're easier to raise and they're cheaper, uh, it's very useful. And plus one movement for converted natives? Yes, please. Continue on. You, what do I want you to be? Hmm. Let's have a look. Uh, did you build a church over there in Port Royal? No, but in two turns you could build one in three turns, so that seems like a plan to me. Firebrand Preacher. Ah, and you? Yes, farmers are free. Good. Good, good, good. How long until you're done? Nine turns. How long until you are done? Five turns. Well. You know what? Stay here. Help out. By increasing the population growth. Get in there. Help out by increasing population growth. There's a good lad. Thank you very much. And you can jump over here too. Because we will need you. Cool, cool. You can jump into a school. And in 14 turns, you'll be able to become something much more than you are currently. Congratulations. Alright. And we should have a wagon train next turn, I believe. Or is it the turn after? Turn after. Ah, an indentured servant. And I saw you there, Spanish caravel. I'm coming for you. <laughs> I see you. 98% odds. Do it. Ah. You are unloaded? Seriously? What the fuck is this shit? Alright, heal up. Now, what do we got? Oh, there. What do we got here? 654, 872. I'm considering paying... You know what? Yes, I will pay for those. Oh, free colonist. Why? Why do you do this to me? I will pay for those because I will take back these goods now. There we go. I'll take back some of these goods now and we'll sell them to gain more money, grab a couple of guys before the tax rate goes up. But I won't purchase that fella now because if we wait a few turns that would be better. Now, I, ooh, I hadn't built a dock, really? We have like an expert fisherman doing stuff, build a dock! Uh, you need to go collect raw goods. Actually, I'm going to set that up as an export as well. So, export of wood. Yes, wood and ore. Where's ore? In this list. I have myself a little list. There we go. And Jamestown. Actually, you can export that too. Well, you can just export, export wood. There we go. 
And Jamestown can import wood and ore. There you go, congratulations, and you can be assigned to that trade route, so sign, not tools, ore, lumber, and lumber. Congratulations, off you go. You can be a veteran. Heal up. And you actually don't need to go over there anymore, so wait. Are you on a trade route? No, you're not. Okay, go there. You can transport other things around, make sure everything is getting done. Continue on! Surplus of seven tools has been sold for stuff. Good. You have a plan, right? No. Oh. You do? Now I'm confused. What have I done? Okay, you're taking... What have I done? Urgh. Okay, you have no orders. You have no orders. You do. You do. Damn it. What the bloody hell have I done? Alright, yeah, do that. Do that. Do that. Done. Okay, you do your own thing. You don't appear to have any orders, so you can do your thing too. Right. Okay, I think I've sorted it out now. Uh, you need to take those tools to... Actually, take 300 tools and take them to Kingsport. Because they needed tools, didn't they, for the fortress? Yes, they did. Do you need tools? No. Good. Because you're not getting any. So there. Continue. Alright. Choose a speciality for the graduating student. He shall be an expert farmer. And you shall... You shall grab a fort, because you can. You... Yes, you need a warehouse. And you can sell all of that stuff. Oh, delicious money. You come here. Get on board. Uh, yes, we'll take you to... Damn it. No, no. Done. Oh, thanks. Cheers, bro. No, Adrian Vanderdonk, you don't get to have access to my lands. Fuck off. Alright. Adrian Vanderdonk is very annoying. He thinks that he's totally got the right to ask you for access to your lands. No, I will not have your missionaries coming through my lands and spying. Because I know that's what they're doing, they're spying. Oh, hey. Oh, right, you're here, aren't you? Wait, did we not build the church? I thought we built the church. No, we didn't build the church. We'll build the church first. I'm an Egypt. That's what I am. Uh, you are worth a bit, so you can sit. And you can go over there. Good, good, good. And just hang out. Excellent. 1648. So hopefully, now you've created a fortress. I want to create a magazine if we can do it quickly. 20 turns. No, we need cannons more. Alright. You can pop those in there. Ah, we're going to be difficult about this. Alright, well, we'll take back. 50 of them. How's that? Well, slightly better. Good enough. Get over there. You can just chill out. You need to bring people. Get over there. You are done. Uh, so you can... Hmm. Is that farm? Yes, it is. You can go to... Hmm, we don't really have a spot that you need to go to. 
Well, we could always get another farm down here, why not? Let's get a farm right there. We need many people. Many people to do many things. Alright, so 1650 is rolling up. Hello, 1650. Hello, Spanish man, what exactly are you doing? I don't know, but it worries me. Guns? You're running out of storage for them? No, this will never do. This will never do at all. Here, take these. Now you need to go over there. Grab me those guns. Alrighty. Yeah, you'll survive. You're all set. Uh, you'll be getting there in one turn. Good, good. How long until you have been trained? Eight turns. Not bad. Not bad at all. Continue on. Fully expect the king to ring up any second now and be like, Oh, so I see you sold me things. Would you like to pay more taxes? Not really. Thanks for asking. There we go. Make stuff. No, nothing there. Continue on. Now. Because you have really good education, you get to go sit in there. 13 turns, 7 turns. Indentured servant, you can sit in there too. 14, 13, 7. Good, 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 good. Um, you can sail over there. It'll probably be quicker. 3 turns. Yeah. Good. They should get a population growth in two turns. Excellent. Excellent, excellent, excellent. And then we can put three students into there. And all should be dandy. Perfect. Alright, continue that fort. 21 to 26 percent. Fine. You're a bastard, you know that. Just FYI. Alright, more crosses are good crosses. You can just chill. And you can build a farm. Hooray! You need to collect all of these guns. Well, most of them. Alrighty, and you can probably go back to making... Yeah, you can need to go back to making tools. So we don't drain them too much. You guys could probably... Oh, no, that would take a long time. We need one of these, though. 700 gold, yeah. It'll do. Um... Go up here, deliver guns. I'm sure we haven't delivered them to here yet. Well, we've delivered some to here. Oh, I put the wrong thing in there. There we go. Much better. Um, go back. Deliver more stuff. Alright, finish the stockade. 32 turns for a fort. Jump in there and be trained in the arts of stuff. You're all set. Price of coats has risen. Excellent. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Um, hmm. You don't really have a job anymore. I kind of put you out of your job, didn't I? Francisco Pizarro has joined Louis de Frontenac. So, he just took one of the most useless founding fathers in the game. Unless you're Spanish. Why? I'm so confused. Uh... Pizarro gives you the looter, um, the looter promotion for free, if I remember correctly. Yep, and basically, looter, unless you are the Spanish and thus declaring war on everybody, mostly the natives, is kind of useless. Especially if you're the French, because the whole point of being the French is that you make nice with the, the uh, natives, and you don't go to war with them, but mm, shows what I know. No! I did all the exploring. You don't get to share my font, my fountain of knowledge. You can sod off, is what you can do. Ooh, how long until you're done? Four turns. Yes, you can go over there. Actually. No, what you can do is you can become a soldier. Congratulations, you've just gotten drafted into the Continental Army. Feel proud that you're serving your country, colony, nation, thing. Alrighty, you can sit in there too, and you can also sit in there. So, 12 turns, 15, 9. 9! Not bad. 
Alright. So, at least one of them is going to become a soldier in the end. Uh, you... Don't really need to do anything, actually. Just, um, just chill for now. When we need to deliver stuff around, we'll be sure to. So, let's have a look at the state of affairs. He has five warships, we have one. And that one warship is our privateer. It's not going to do the job. Not even remotely. He's got 17 regulars. I'm confident that if we were fighting in uh, defensive positions, we could hold them off. He's got 10 regular dragoons and 17 artillery to our one dragoon and no cannons. Yes, he gets artillery, we get cannons. Artillery is indeed the upgrade version of cannons. So, yeah. Bonzies. But the reason I've been distributing guns everywhere is because once we take... Um, once we declare independence... Oh dear, he's alarmed at the rebel sentiment. He's had six new units. Oh, well, that wasn't very nice of you. You bastard. <laughs> Why is he alarmed? We aren't even producing Liberty Bells anymore, are we? Oh no, we are. We're producing some Liberty Bells. Right. Forgot about that. Um, well, that's alright. Could be worse. We're going to put at least two of these guys over to being um, Elder Statesmen. Because we will finally want to begin building up our Liberty Bells. Okay. Uh, you've constructed a fortress in Kingsport. What would you like to do next? Next, I would like to get some more military points because I would really, really love to be able to pick up um, Don Pedro at some point. Actually, we're really close to being able to get enough uh, military points for that. What we're actually lacking now is political points, of all things. So, on second thought... You guys can do... No. Political. No. Political. Political points for you. You're building a fort. You sort of need that first. Uh, you're also building a fort. You do sort of need that first. You're doing military points. Let's go with political points for you too. Just to make sure we got enough. Coolio. And let us continue. You still actually aren't seeing anything, just just FYI. Uh, let's see. Ideally, ideally we'd be making enough money right now that we could actually scratch that. We will make enough money. We'll start buying guns off the King of England <laughs> just to fuck with him. There we go. So we're going to sell all of this stuff. It's probably not going to make it... Actually, let's see. Are any of these worth more? Probably. So we'll sell that instead. We're going to fuck with the King of England just because we can. Sail home. Alright. You need to be an elder statesman. And you need to go... A town that does not have one. Fort William, meh. They can live without one. Georgetown has one. Point Silverton does not. Yes, that is where you are going. You can sit in there and make tools for now. Carry on. Uh, you don't need to do anything there. Mm. <sighs> damn. Damn, 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 damn. Hmm. Ideally, we'd be picking up people like Samuel Adams and John Jay and Patrick Henry, but apparently I haven't been po producing enough political points lately. Very strange. That's alright. I've been gearing it up far too much towards um, military founding fathers, unfortunately. But that's okay, we can deal with it, we can get there. Uh, warehouse? No. Actually, maybe. Hmm. Get a cathedral first. Hello. Goodbye. You had absolutely nothing worth it on you. Oh, hey, we took no damage. Sweet. Sweet. Okie dokie. Continue on. Right, sell all of that. 16k. Not bad. Sail home. 
Oh, I forgot to buy guns. I'm an idiot. Well, we'll just send him back again. Now you need to jump in here. 